What's good, TMG fam? It's your boy, Ellen Queen, and we back with another reaction. How y'all feel? Welcome back to the channel. Salute. Listen, man, she's finally here to witness one of these with us, fam. Everybody, y'all ready? Y'all ready? This is a live PD segment we about to get into. I know you haven't been around for none of these, but this is some fun yeah, right I here. I heard you just been, you know, going rogue, doing your own thing. So okay. listen, live PD, this is the best what you rich... Been doing? I'm telling you, you about to see. <laughs> but it's about to, this is crazy. Live PD, best of Richland County, South Carolina. Richland? Uh-uh. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to see this one. Oh, man. No, 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 no. Here we go. We're going to pull this car over for an expired tag. It's left from an undrug location. There's a lot of movement in the car. You want a 1018? <laughs> That's a good question. Queen was like, what does 1018 mean? Somebody give us the code. He said, he said, if we're going to be police officers or, you know what I'm saying, we're going to be, huh? We're going to be police officers? You, 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 we'll bring you up to speed, but we've been we've been doing this. We've been solving cases here and everything, man. I'm telling you, you've been missing out. So listen, yeah, we got to figure out these 10 codes next, all right? Oh, <laughs> How are you doing? All right. Put your hands up on here for me. How are y'all doing? Can you roll the window down for me? Huh? Can you roll the window down for me? Huh? I'm Deputy Florida Sheriff's Department. Pulled you over because your plates are expired on the ta on your car. Oh, hold on. Do you have your driver's license on you? Whose car is this? Come on, man, and I can call her right now. Okay. Hey. You any guns or anything on you? No, sir. Okay. Weapon. How about? Weapon. You have any weapons on you, partner? Sir, they just been around. Yeah. Nah, look. The tag's expired. I need to talk to you for a second. Can you just hang up the phone so I can talk to you? I gotta call you right back. <laughs> he, he got out of the car already copping please listen they just picked me up uh they just you alerting to something wrong right now open your mouth for me open your mouth for me why open your mouth for me what's in his mouth ain't nothing in there open your mouth I, i'm gonna get it for you i swear to god I ask them what I do. I pick my teeth with plastic. Open your mouth. I'm about to get it. There's nothing in there. Look, Open it's your mouth. Spit it out. Look, it's empty piece of plastic. Nothing, six, it was six, nothing nine, in there. Six, nine. It was nothing in there. You're just being detained. You're not under arrest, OK? OK. All right. It was nothing in there. OK. We're going to have a canine come over here, see if it, we can get a hit on the car. I'm all right? I want to ask for consent to search your vehicle without having to use my dog. Wait, this is this is real. This is this is this is this. I tried to let you know what we've been getting into here lately. The, this this is, fool just put out a whole lot of saran wrap and said it was. And they calling the dog, meaning they finna figure out either he gonna give him consent to go in there or they gonna get, bring the dog out and the dog gonna give him consent. Either or. I tried to warn you what we're getting. This fool just spit out a whole roll he of tried, saran wrap. Somebody he swallowed it. He swallowed it. He swallowed it. Oh, man. Damage that I want to minimize. Okay. The quicker we get this thing, the quicker we can get out of the way. So you, you're not going to give it. You want to run a dog? Okay. There's nothing in there. What was that? Huh? What was that? That would be an alert. I told you what was happening. Look in there. There's nothing in there. Oh, my gosh. Bit the seat off. He bit it off. What? So, the dog. Pot That's the first time I seen that. For him. The last thing we saw the other day was a dog hop in to the car through the window. He bit the seat off, fam. He bit the seat off. Not oh. that. Oh. Positively alerted on the vehicle, as we can see. And uh, we're gonna search the vehicle and any remnants in front, inside, and try and find some sort of narcotics or what the cause of the alert was. That would be why my dog bit. No, it's not. Yes, it is. And that's a laxative. You, you're gonna wanna test that. A laxative? I thought he just said, whoa. I thought he just said, who's going to get some stuff out of his teeth? That's a laxative, huh? It's like a uh, sawed off shotgun here. And it's loaded. 12 gauge. You're free to go. You're under arrest and you're under arrest. The backseat passenger, he didn't have anything on him. He was released. The front passenger, he went for the gun that was up under the seat and then the driver has warrants and is prohibited from being around firearms. So he's going for that as well. The bag that was in his mouth, I think it was some sort of ecstasy or MDMA because he started sweating really bad. He was very jittery. We're gonna test the substance, see if we can identify what it is. Did he just leave the car there? How you feel? 
This is crazy. <laughs> my my reaction first time I seen it too. I've been hooked ever since. I had to get you here. This is the best thing we found so this far. This is crazy. It gets crazier. Oh man. Uh, we got some apartments over here pretty infested with some drug activity, gang activity. We just had a shooting out here the other night. Hey, you got one walking in a white t-shirt. I'm gonna go around to the other side. Got one cutting through this building right here. I'm gonna get up with. Right now for you. Oh. Why are you coming from up there? I live over here. Okay. I thought there was a cut here to get to the store right there. Oh, to get to the store? Okay. All right. What are you looking for? Were you smoking weed just now? No. There was a, a black guy that was over there. He was smoking weed. Where was he at? He went through that neighborhood. Okay. You don't have anything on you, right? No, no. <laughs> yeah, I can smell it coming off you. No, come here. Come here. Come here. Me. Kelly, you want to check her real quick? I'm going to go check that. Oh, no, Lord. Lord. Are y'all serious? Hey, Do you check. have anything on you, man? Yes or no? No. Stop. Okay, please do not grab me like that. Thank well, you. when I ask so you to stop, I don't have then nothing in my pocket. That means stop. Can you get? What yeah, do you do? That's nothing. That's a cigarette. Yeah, you like weed me. No, that's a cigarette. You like weed me. Did you get it? What am I being arrested for? You're not being arrested, man. You're okay. being detained right now. For what? For what? Let me ask you a question. What's the simple question? question? Yes. You smoke weed. We I don't smoke it. weed. Listen, we, get, we smelled it coming off you when you walked down the hill. There was a black guy that was, he you know went right through the neighborhood. <laughs> I don't know what he did. He was right here. He was, he was trying he to say. <laughs> she said, I don't know what he did. Hey, man, why you got to put it off on somebody else? Some black guy up there. <laughs> he on me and right there, and that's a boy. You better leave me alone. I'm going to see my boyfriend. I'm trying to find the best cut through there. You got dope on you. You got, we saw you walking down the hill and went by yourself. Yeah, she put it yes, out right there. Okay, oh okay. By the right. mailbox right there. I'm okay. just being detained. I like to be uh, released unless I've No, you know what? Crime. You are under arrest. For what? Loading for purpose of narcotics and, and possession of marijuana. I don't have any narcotics. You got marijuana. That, that's not mine. Where'd it come from? I told you it was that black guy with the dreads. All right, cool. You need to work on real crime. They need to come. The you out here smoking dope around these kids. You see what type of police work they're doing? They didn't even go after the real criminal. Seriously, I haven't committed a crime. I'm telling you right now. I have not committed a crime. Do not use force on me. You understand me? I don't think you should have that type of tone right now. Ooh. Look at it, man. Hey, 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 don't, don't run up. Don't run up. Don't. Right don't. Hey, come here. I'll talk to you. Come here. Come here. No, no. I'll nah, talk to you. Come here, man. Away. Come here. Away. Aw, oh, man. Come here. You know her? Hell hey, no. hey, check this out. Oh. She's up top of the hill smoking a blunt. There was nobody with her. <laughs> she up there smoking a roach and marijuana. And then she's going to make up this game. We're watching her the whole time. There's nobody around her. She's got the weed in her pocket. She shouldn't be out here smoking marijuana. So she's going to take that ride. And had she not turned it the way she turned it, she would have been given a ticket and got bounced out of here. But because she started acting the way she did, we got to take her. There's just no way. So she'll be out in a couple hours, though. So. I feel like I'm getting hurt to be a white, black neighborhood. Really? Oh my gosh. She said she's being persecuted for being white in a black neighborhood. Nah, it wasn't the way you're going off. It's not the way you're acting. It's not the, the stuff they found on you. It's, your, it's because of your race right now and being in a black neighborhood. Oh my God. Please, please alert the press. Stop the press. Seriously, I think this is reverse discrimination. Reverse discrimination in Richland County. I thought Lexington County was bad, but damn, y'all do that over at Richland? I saw y'all doing your police work. I walked the opposite way because I didn't want to disturb y'all. <laughs> I appreciate it. But when you go about doing business like this, this is ridiculous. I have first amendment rights. I have the right to speak my mind. If you check for footprints, you will notice footprints leaving from there of a man. And if you check that neighborhood right there, you'll see that somebody left the scene. And so you're arresting the wrong person. Okay, it was in your pocket, in your possession. Sir, I can't help. You're being charged with the possession. Of what? Of the marijuana that was in what? your pocket. 
how much marijuana is in there, sir. What is that? I told, I was told it was a cigarette. That's all I know. Oh! I was told you were a cigarette, so you put cigarettes. So you didn't know what you were smoking? Yeah, I did. When I'm running low. She's gonna go for at least loitering and then for uh, like she possession really of marijuana. Have a cigarette, huh? All this drama for no reason. I'm gonna buy you breakfast one day, Brown. I forgive you, man. She probably would have walked away with a ticket had she not started screaming all that stuff. Let's go. Let's go. Here we got a call for shots fired. Huh? I get excited. New see? call, new opportunities, new see? finds. Tired. We're just gonna go out there and see what we can find. Somebody breathing hard as I don't know what, bro. You out of breath Maybe already? Camera. Maybe it's the camera person. County Sheriff's Department. That thing just came open by itself? No, he opened the door. 424 ambulance down. Suspect down. Suspect. How the door got open? The cop opened the door. He opened the door. And when he did, he saw the body. Department. Hey, Sheriff's Department, show me your hands. Show me your hands right now. Who else in the house? Who else is in here? Um, just me and my roommate. Oh! Stop right there and don't move. Oh, God. And there's guns. Like, everybody okay? Like, I just woke up. You just woke up! She said she just woke up! Two Girl. bodies in the living room. You good she back there? Me. All right, walk this way. Is he okay? He's just on the ground right now. We're gonna check him out. <laughs> Step over. Is he okay? Is step, he step, step over. Outside. Step over. What the f is going on? <laughs> We're figuring it out right now, but in not in the. What the f is wrong? <laughs> so you didn't hear anything going on in there. <laughs> Until we get things figured out, I'm just gonna have you sitting in the car. It's safer there, okay? Heck yeah. Have a seat. Huh? That's weird. Those guys that are in the house. Okay. Who are they to you? My roommates. They're your roommates. How many roommates total do you have? Two. We What's got we, we got two down inside. What? Has she been hit or? Two? No, she she was asleep apparently what? through the whole thing in the back room. Please tell me they're okay. You can sleep through a gunshot? So. Huh? I guess maybe you have on earplugs. Maybe she had some, took some sleep medicine. Cause she seems kind of off. Fam, if she slept through that. Dude, the Christmas tree fell. You slept through that. We said a, I slept through a Christmas tree. The Fall. arms went off. You slept through that. There were several things that I had to wake you up. I ain't sleeping through no gunshot, though. That's why I'm like, you know, some people sleep hard. <laughs> we're figuring that out now, okay? You didn't hear anything? You don't know anything? No. You don't know anybody that they might be enemies with? They were, I thought they were arguing for a short second, but I thought they got over it. And see, typically with roommates, you know, they're probably annoying you, so you're probably going to try to tune them out. You know what I'm saying? True, that, that's true. So you probably just try to go in your room, close your door, block them out. I know. I, 
there was a bunch of uh, green plant material on the ground that we believed to be marijuana. It could have possibly been a, a bad drug transaction, but we're still figuring that out right now. Who you got inside? We got two individuals that are on the ground, apparent uh, gunshot wounds, um, unresponsive. I think last I saw, EMS was doing CPR. Both of them had guns right in their reach. The dude behind the door still had the gun in his hand, finger on the trigger. EMS, they came in, performed CPR after checking for a pulse, checking for life, that uh, they were deceased. So we have two individuals that are deceased right now inside the home. Dang! You slept through it. Woo! So we're just about ready to pull up on a shop that did larceny in progress. Got an update that the individual is still inside. Mm -hmm. Said all black. Let's go. Yes, him right here? No. Him right here? Yeah. I can show you the camera what he did. I work hard for my money. Hmm. Yeah. 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 I work hard 12 hours, 7 days. And I don't take nobody money. I don't want to be. I don't. I don't want nobody take my uh, my stuff. I didn't know it was like that. Why you not ask me? I will give it to you. I understand. I understand that. Sometimes you. I'm not trying to give. You didn't. You didn't know it was like that. You, you didn't know it was. It was illegal to take something you don't, don't belong to you and put it in your pocket and try to. Well, don't apologize to me, sir. You. Ain't. I know. I know. Huh? I know. It's, 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 you, I can show you the camera right now. And, I mean, for both sides. He take the two sausage from him and go to the back, put them in the back, and he come back, take, take two of these, take two of these, and put one back and one behind him. If he want to go to jail for four dollar candy, sometime he ask me, I give him a dollar. You not worth to go to jail for four dollars. If you ask me, I will pay you. I will, I will give you a credit. No. You still my shit, you're gonna go to jail for it. Did you come here and steal that? that, that yes, food? Why'd you do that? Why'd you do that? Um, just, I'm in a homeless shelter right now. I needed something for food tomorrow because I go in there. I wake up at they were here at 4. I go to work, don't come home till 5 30. That whole day I'm working at walking around, no food, nothing. Right. Well, understand it. I'm gonna. I gotta ask him again, okay? But, but he say you want to first charges, right? So with that being said, you're gonna be placed under arrest for 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 larceny, for petty larceny, okay? I'm gonna arrest. All right. Hey. Dang. 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 No, I don't the owner said. The owner said I would have gave you. You know what I'm saying? If you'd have just came in there and said something. I believe him too. It's like that he really is homeless or something. I'm like, why he, why you didn't run? Like, no, nah, he didn't run at all. He stayed right there. And then, dang, four dollars? You put you up for four dollars? Like, what? petty larceny. It's too late, so I, can, I, can, I can't unarrest somebody, unfortunately. Um, I know, I know, this day, he go day, he go day. Yes, sir. I mean, he try hard, but I You come out, you come out. Let's, let's tell him what's inside. Huh? Um, I, I understand. I really do. I understand what you what, what you mean by that, okay? But since a crime has been committed and he said that he wants to press charges, I can't unarrest somebody, okay? Um, so maybe, you know, Hopefully that, maybe. I, I promise you maybe. I, maybe I uh, well, that, that's your right, and that you have to talk to the judge about that, okay? But right now, um, I, I, can't, I can't change that, okay? So, it, unfortunately, it is what it is, okay? All right, yep, you got it. Mm -hmm. Yep, you got it. Aww. We're not in the business of unarrest. It doesn't, it doesn't work that way. So, unfortunately, I wish they would have said that sooner for his sake. Um, he doesn't have a, a bad criminal record, and he just seems to be in a bad situation. He just made a bad decision today. Hit it to a bad boys. What you want? What you gonna do? Incident where an individual shot into a residence. Uh, one of the projectiles actually went through the garage door. The caller stated she heard three gunshots. 
It smells like gunpowder here. Hey, how you doing, ma'am? Did you call? Yes, I called. I heard, like, pop, pop. Did you hear where they might be coming from? Like, over there, over there? I, I don't know exactly where it was coming, because when I, the garage door was closed and I was getting things out of my car. Okay. And I just didn't know what hit the door, you know. Okay, so it hit this garage door over here? Yes, sir, that's what I heard the sound from. Okay. Oh, wow. You can see where the bullet hit the brick. But again, you don't know exactly where they might have been coming from. No, sir. So. Yeah, okay. All right, that's good. What are you doing coming from back there? Out the front door. Where are you headed to? Go ahead and turn around for me. Keep your hands at your pocket. Come here. What's in your front right pocket? What's in your front right pocket? What's in your front right pocket? There is a gun? Oh my God. All right. Exactly what I thought. He kept the gun on him? Somebody said in the comment section, there's a lot of dumb criminals out there. Like, what you keep the gun on you for? You have a CW? Come on, cops. Y'all gotta stop touching these guns with y'all finger press, too. <laughs> I'd be like, why y'all be touching them? Hey. Alright, well, now you're under arrest for unlawful carrying a pistol, you understand? Oh. Turn up a seat for me. Can you get his information and start running him, please? Are you allowed to have a firearm? Uh -huh. So you're gonna be a felon in possession as well? Yeah. Alright, sounds good. You don't wanna talk to me at all? Nope. Huh? Lawyer. You want a lawyer? Okay, sounds good. It's gonna be a burst of 380, so we'll run the serial number. Hopefully, uh, it doesn't come back stolen, but it is. if it does, then it's gonna be another charge for him. He's out here just playing around with a gun and shooting at stuff and shooting at people's houses. It's pretty dangerous, so we're gonna nip that in the bud real quick. We're going to go ahead and take the projectile and put it in evidence and let the investigations process it and see what they can get from it and see if it's connection with the gun that we oh, Randomly shooting people houses? Like, I guess it ain't that much to do in, in uh, Richland. I don't know. Maybe we got to call Mama T. <laughs> Down on this individual. We got him off the street, so you don't have to worry about hopefully nothing else happening tonight or any time. Oh, uh, no, ma'am. He doesn't live here. He doesn't live around here. No, so. So. Okay, All right. Thank you so much for coming out. Yes, ma'am. A further investigation that pistol stolen um, from a business along with 11 other pistols that are still outstanding. Um, so this individual is being charged with possession of stolen pistol and unlawful carry. Uh, he also has a, a warrant out of North Carolina for probation, so he's going to be uh, transferred up to North Carolina after these charges. Bye-bye. Wow. What a good day's work we had right there. Glad we could bring you along. Okay. A lot of people, you know, we took down the night. You feel good about yourself? <laughs> this is interesting. Yo, this uh is we be getting into these live PDs, fam. Oh we get God. into these live PDs like going to work for the day. You yeah. know what I mean? It's yeah, fine. man. Yeah, we're just doing our part, you know. Just trying to do that's our right. part. That's right. Keeping Make sure the keeping the yeah, community safe. safe. Yeah, that's protected. What, that's what we that's do. A, you yeah, know? yeah. We got a lot of drugs off the street tonight. You know, guns off the street. We got some criminals off the street. You know, we we, we put in a pretty good day's work, but it's still a lot more we can do. Still we got drugs on the street. Hey, dude, a dude swallowed something. <laughs> So we got him and the drugs inside of him okay. off the street. <laughs> he swallowed something, so. But y'all get at us in the comment section, man. Let us know what y'all thought of the video, man. Leave a like, share the video, subscribe, and stick around and stay tuned to the next reaction. We out. Peace. Y'all stay solid. Hey.